So a few days ago, I was just thinking of what to post on YouTube because I haven't posted something in a while. And I was just browsing through YouTube and I happened to find this guy, Dom Tracy, and his shocked ass face. Like he just found out that he was adopted. If you couldn't tell from the thumbnail that I just showed, his videos are just a bit clickbait. To say the least, and I've watched a few of them, and <laughs> oh my gosh, I cannot tell, and I can't tell why he has 1 million subscribers, or almost 2 million at this point. Now, I'm going to watch some of these with you guys, and I hope that you guys like this video, so let's get this video started. So this first video that I have for you guys is of him with the nun. But let me just prepare you guys because you guys might lose some brain cells and the will to live just from watching this video. For her. We're gonna go look outside the front door. What the? F <laughs> Holy now there's a few things wrong with this clip. I mean, why in the world does the nun look like some fucking kid on Halloween or some shit? And secondly, you already know, he's blurring out all them cussing just to get that ad revenue. Yo, please tell me you guys are seeing oh this. God. Do you see that, yo? What's that? What the Honestly, this isn't even fucking scary. I mean, they're just yanking on that shit door like their father's about to see their browser history or some shit. Where's she going? Where's she going? What the f Dude. You know, I always wonder, what if there's this guy just walking down the street and he happens to find this Yankee Danky doodoo shite happening, and it's just, it'll just be looking so confused. I mean, you're just walking down the street, just minding your own damn business, and then you happen to see a white-faced nun in front of a house scaring these two kids. What do you do in that situation? Do you help? I mean... It would most likely be occurred as a prank from an adult, but like, just imagine, you're just walking down the street, just minding your own business, and that happens. I mean, do they, what do they think? Do they think that they're crazy? Do they think that this is fucking fake or something? I don't even know. Yo, what the f is going on, dude? This is actually happening. What the heck? This is actually happening right now. I gotta go upstairs, dude. We need to get more of this. This is good ass footage. Who the hell is thinking about something like that? When somebody is visiting your house, like let's say that some that some intruder or some, some somebody is just outside your house in some creepy ass dress, and you decide to think, oh man, this is some good ass footage. Like who the fuck thinks about that? You know, I'm not even sure how these gullible ass kids still think that this is real. I mean, maybe, maybe if this was like 2010 or so, then maybe it could be more believable. But this is certainly, f I mean. It's just cringeworthy to watch. I'll hold the door open. Dude. be honest who the fuck does that i mean you just go outside and encounter the person who is just outside your house just creepily standing and shit i mean why would you do that i mean honestly if it were me i would literally just walk just stay in my house and do nothing i mean they're not gonna get shit from here and if they were if i was going outside i would at least bring some weapon or something with me like a knife or a bat or anything but not go outside barehanded knowing how creepy and all that they are now, Dom Tracy is also known for even more cringeworthy stuff, like, uh, the most notable one is Killer Clown Videos, a trend that has died two years ago, which, so, for some reason, he still does. Now, the latest one that he's done that's extremely cringeworthy is the one that says, A creepy killer clown kidnaps my sister, not clickbait. HOLY SHIT! 
Do you know what this means? It's not clickbait. It means it's real, guys. Like, you already know. He says no clickbait, and it obviously means no clickbait. Alright, guys. So, basically, I'm here with my sister, Bell Say, what's up? Hi. And, uh, basically, the killer clown just texted me. I'm outside. Did you hear his sister? She sounds so unenthusiastic about this video. I mean, she already knows that it's clickbait. And he's literally going to put not clickbait on the title. She sounds so sad that her brother's making money out of this. She's already opening the garage. It's locked, dude. Whoa. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Dude. What the is going on? What's going on? Oh my god, he's getting out there, dude. I'm not going out there. He's going. I'm not going out there. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, that's my sis. Oh my god, dude. He just kidnapped her. You have to be the most shittiest brother in the world to literally just watch your sister get kidnapped by a clown. I mean, firstly, you're just standing there, just recording her, like, ooh, ooh, I'm not going out there. Who does that? What are you? Are you a mo You're worse than the clown himself, man. I mean, seriously. I mean, I had to skip most of that because it was just unenthusiastic, except for the end. I hate these two videos like that. Now, I have one more Dom Tracy video that just combines two outrageously dead trends. His killer clown videos and 3 a.m. videos. You cannot get any more dead than that. I see you on the sidewalk right now. Walk forward, and forward is in there where the pond is. Alright, here we go. Gotta walk forward. You see, my whole thing is, with these videos, is why in the world do you want to go outside and actually look for him? I mean, sure, maybe your mom didn't raise no bitch, but, like, here's the thing. You just don't really do that in an actual society. Who would ever do that? I'm not sure that if you guys would do that, but I know that I wouldn't. Because that's just insane. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, yo. No way. I'm so scared. I don't know why. I don't know where to go. Where to walk. I don't know if I should go inside or or what. But I'm terrified. And that was the end of his video. He dead ass just went outside, got a couple of texts, and nothing happened. Honestly, that was, that was actually the end of his video. There was literally nothing that actually happened other than a few texts. Who in the world does clickbait like that? I mean, clickbait, I mean, at least you have to have at least something fake in it, but at the very least, have something fake in it, because, like, you can't just have a video with virtually nothing happening. It's it's just confusing. Now, that's going to wrap up this video today, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed it, and, yeah, uh, if you guys like these commentaries, um, please just ask me in the comments if I should do more, and I'm just trying to, you know, give you as much content, like, trying to see which content fits me best and if and if this content fits good then i'll just do more of it and thank you guys for watching this video hope you guys enjoyed it can we hit 10 likes and i'll see you guys in the next Yo, video the peace in west philadelphia born and raised on the playground is where i spent both of my days chilling out max and relaxing all cool and all shooting some b-ball outside of the school when a couple of guys who were up to no good started making trouble in my neighborhood i got in one little fight and my mom got scared and said you're moving with me